So um, I set this up last month, um, and it will continue, and we will continue to um, let our statement be known that we will not let anyone take our second rate rights from us whatsoever. Anybody else? Good. Burgers ready. So, Mark, what's the most bothered some of the things that you said? Actually, I could say there's nothing about Kate Brown that I have positive to say until she's legal for all people, all lives, and I want justice for the assassination of Lavoy Finnegan as well. So are you, and are you mentioning um, the police having more rights to the police or what was bothering Kate Brown does not believe in the second time. Where would they be? So I was noticing um, that there are about five people I saw on Facebook page coming together. We're coming from pretty much, it looked like all over Oregon. I was yes, saying, and Portland. Washington, Colorado, yes. Okay, so would you say it's pretty much Pacific Northwest at this point that you're gathering a lot of Yeah, yeah, a lot of the Pacific Northwest. Yeah. And, uh, we are for everybody. We are not just for one group. We are for all Americans and all those who live in this country. They all deserve to have their rights and have justice. And there's just too much injustice. And uh, even our police lives matter. But corruption is corruption, and there's no in between. It's good or evil at this point. And all Americans are starting to see that. There's no in-between anymore. It's either good or evil. And this isn't about um, just necessarily any group trying to get anybody to... No, this is to give knowledge out and to educate people. There's a lot of people out there who are not educated, but that need to be educated. And it's important. And people need to um, also uh, take the time to learn how to properly use a weapon if they're going to handle, you know, a gun and whatnot. They need to learn gun safety as well. Okay. So we're here to do all those things for everybody. And is this uh, the first time you've been together in events like down here in Brown, or is this following? No, this is our second one. Okay. Um, and then we'll have one that is also next month, September 3rd, okay. and that will be in Portland. And what's that focus That is going to be... Uh, for the corruption, it's going to be for injustice, and it will be our group on Facebook, All Lives Matter, and it will be All Lives Matter Against Injustice, and that will be on Zoom. Okay. And how did you initially become a part of the group, or were you one of the sort of co-founders? I know. Okay. okay. And what was it stepped out of initially? Was it out of starting to on legislation, or? With all the corruption, and Kate Brown being a major part of it. Anything in particular that sort of... She has not done anything ethical for all people. I don't have anything to say except she, anything she has done has not been to the benefit of the people of Oregon or even to the United States. Same with Hillary Clinton. And then how uh, did the group initially contact Mark Callahan or uh, coordinate with the students? I saw that was one of the speakers today. We're supporters of Mark Callahan and we stay in contact with Mark. Okay. So was he initially one of you that had said that he'd speak when it first started, or did you contact him? No, we did contact all of our speakers, yes. And then we asked them to come and speak. Yeah. And then I was wondering, um, sorry, I'm going to No, no problem at all. I was also wondering, because I saw a couple different organizations, if there were any key organizations that were partnering um, on the gun front. Yeah, Oregon 3%. Absolutely. They are the most peaceful, knowledgeable people. And they are about the American people. They are about all lives. They're not picky. And um, they're a great group of people. We're very knowledgeable and educational. They are going to, they have good representation. They, and they have a very good reputation um, with a lot of churches, a lot of groups. Um, they're totally peaceful.
Yeah. And I see too, um, a couple of years ago, Mark Callahan was running for um, representatives, House representatives. Um, we've gotten some support um, from the gun side, and so I was wondering if that is initially when it came on your radar. No, I've been supporting Mark Callahan from the beginning. Yeah, okay. uh, he has integrity, and um, he wants um, what is best, and I am for that. I am. He is for all people. All groups of good, and I'm for anything that's of good, anything that's of righteousness, I am for. But if it's immoral, unethical, forget it. Yeah. And then I wanted to check up on the hashtag to All Lives Matter because I know yes. that's been getting a lot of attention, especially with events that have happened. Was that one of the reasons that was said on Facebook, or what was the like? Um, actually, that was behind because everybody keeps segregating, and it needs to quit being segregated, and all people need to come together and promote you and stand as one for what is right. And like I said, there's no in between. It's either good or evil. So either you have the good come together or you have the evil come together and everybody keeps picking sides of who is who on what side. Yeah. And the hashtag itself has gotten a little bit of a uh, sort of a negative connotation in the last week or so with people saying that that's saying that the uh, Black Lives Matter movement is uh, basically giving it less validity. What would be your response to that? Any, any group, any individual who promotes uh, violence or harm, um, I don't support it. And I want support. And to me, I understand why they have Black Lives Matter. I understand why everybody has their group name. I get all that. But take all the names away. We are all people. We all believe the same. Everybody needs to have unity. And President Obama and all of them, just like the LGBT needs to come stand with us, everybody needs to come stand with us. We will support them, and we are here for them as well. We are not here for one particular person or one group. We are here for everyone. And then one other thing I wanted to address, and I'm not sure if you followed up from Peter Brown's comments from last week, um, where she was talking about um, because the was not but, um, I wanted to check about your statement on the three days. Uh, again, background checks. That's one thing she wanted to tighten up. What was your statement? I, as I said, I believe in the Constitution and the Second Amendment should not be infringed upon upon I can't, I cannot. So you wouldn't be supportive of I'm not supportive of that. No. Okay. And I think that very much uh, okay. Yeah, I'll take it. Yeah, I appreciate it. I might want to introduce you to our photographer, Molly. Okay. 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 Okay.